It's the weather that can make or break the garden sometimes, and this year has been back and forth. Yes, it has. Some crops took a hit, some prospered. Storm Team 10's Joseph Danes visits the summer garden to take a look. It changes from season to season. It's been up and down. Some crabs dig the weather and others find the dirt. And when you want rain, it's not there. When you do, you, you know. Emil Vichy has had luck this season, but others are questioning some of the crop. Trisha Weaver, garden expert, knows why. It was the weather. In the cool season crops were digging it, but the warm season crops weren't happy. Well, there's no question this bee definitely prospered, but the tomatoes? Well, the tomatoes are a different story. A lot of people are complaining about not getting tomatoes, but that's because they need a certain amount of heating degree days, and they were not getting them until mid-July. With the lack of heat, that has left some gardeners giving up, cutting those rotten tomatoes down and preparing for fall. But Weaver says, don't wave the green thumb yet. There's still time. No, I would not give up. You may not get the crop you normally get, because we're only got about six or so weeks of hot weather left for the year, but you will get a crop of tomatoes. It will just be smaller than usual. Now, perseverance brings the bounty in. If not, hey, the sunflowers are looking good. In Terre Haute, Joseph Dames, Storm Team 10. A weaver says every year is different and you just have to roll with the weather sometimes.